boom, ba ba boom, ba ba boom. <laughs> and now, the one you've all been waiting for, the four-time champion, our own Bill Travis. <laughs> I got 10 riding on you myself, Billy boy. All right, are you ready? Hands behind your backs, gentlemen. Drum roll. Hey, Lord ass, chow down, wide load. <laughs> Go! <laughs> If you want to hold out, boy. What the audience didn't know was that Lardass wasn't really interested in winning. What he wanted was revenge. And right before he was introduced, he'd gotten ready for it. Celebrity contestant from KLAM in Portland, the <coughs> boss man himself, Bob Cornell. Hey, from the Rags and Stacks, it's the best on wax. How about another double golden golden twin spin? Down sandwich from KLAM in Portland. It's Doug! Lardass! 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 Diving into his fifth pie. Lardass began to imagine that he wasn't eating pies. He pretended he was eating cow flops and rat guts and blueberry sauce. Lardass! 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 Slowly, a sound started to build in Lardass' stomach. A strange and scary sound, like a log truck coming at you at 100 miles an hour. Lardass opened his mouth, and before Bill Travis knew it, he was covered with five pies worth of used blueberries. The women in the audience screamed. Boss man Bob Cormier took one look at Bill Travis and barfed on Principal Wiggins. Principal Wiggins barfed on a lumberjack that was sitting next to him. Mayor Grundy barfed on his wife's tits. But when the smell hit the crowd, that's when Lardass' plan really started to work. Girlfriends barfed on boyfriends. Kids barfed on their parents. A fat lady barfed in her purse. The Donnelly twins barfed on each other. And the women's auxiliary barfed all over the benevolent order of antelopes. And Lardass just sat back and enjoyed what he'd created. A complete and total barforama. That was the best, just the best yeah. that would happen. What do you mean? I mean, what happened? What do you mean, what happened? That's the end. How can that be the end? What kind of an ending is that? What happened to Lardass? I don't know. Um, maybe he went home and celebrated with a couple of cheeseburgers. Jeez, that ending sucks. Why don't you make it so that, so that Lardass goes home and he shoots his father, and then he runs away, and, and he joins the Texas Rangers. How about that? Uh, I don't know. Something good like that. I like the ending. The barfing was really good. But there's one thing I couldn't understand. Did Lardass have to pay to get in the contest? No, Vern. They just let him in. Oh! Oh, great. Great story. Yeah, it's a great story, Gordy. I just didn't like the ending. Hey, Bruno, where's the radio? Let's see if we can get some sounds. 